Famous Numerological Profiles Illustrating the Personalities, Destinies and Pivotal Events for Two Celebrities so before we get into the free course, I just wanted to share with you what you can access if you do decide to do the full Portals Numerology course. As you can see, it's broken up into three sections. The first one is called Basic, and that's where we look at the uh, curriculum um, and the details about Portals Numerology and course navigation and so on. We're also covering from Modules 1A to 1D the history of numerology and numbers, superstitions and the portals method, base numbers, symbolism for the personality, house numbers and situations, the destiny or life path, including possible health issues and suggested careers, and combinations of numbers and repeating numbers in the birth date. In the second section, which is called Graphic, we have modules 2A through 2E, which covers the grids, the arrows and missing numbers using the birth date, the name, karmic lessons, inner self, hidden tendencies and so on, the life cycles, which are the circumstances in your life, and the pinnacles, which are the opportunities, yearly interpretations, including personal years and essences, and compatibility charts and yearly maps. And the final section is called Magic, where we learn about dream numbers, tarot associations and numbers in magic and ritual. Famous numerological profile we'll be focusing on is Marilyn Monroe, just to illustrate the interpretation process. And then further studies, becoming a numerologist and finding your own style. That's in modules 3A through 3C. So if you do like this free course and you decide you want to head on over to my website, you'll see the details at the end of this video. Introduction. In this free mini course, we'll be exploring the personality, the destiny and pivotal event for two celebrities, Angelina Jolie and Jim Carrey. I will be sharing the basic calculations for the personality, the destiny and personal year to give you a hint of what to expect in the Portals Numerology course. Jim Carey Date of birth, January the 17th, 1962 Personality, 8 Destiny, 9 Pivotal event, 1994, which was a 5 universal year and for Jim, a 5 personal year. Notable outcomes for 1994, Jim became famous with the lead roles in Ace Ventura, Pet Detective, The Mask and Dumb and Dumber, all released in 1994. The Personality 8 Those born on the following days, reduced to a single digit, have a Personality 8. 8, 17, 26. For example, 17 when reduced to a single digit, is 1 plus 7, which equals 8. This is an individual who exudes wealth, success and accomplishment, or at least strives for it with determined ambition. Using their skills and talents to impress, they are often seen as boisterously aggressive when it comes to putting their best foot forward, and they can often be intimidating. They are not shy when it comes to locking horns with others. The eight personality is someone who comes across as powerful and confident, often taking over and showing who's boss. Material possessions, social status and strength are important to them, and they thrive on progress, the quicker the better, and they always get what they want using whatever means possible. Destiny 9, The Humanitarian How to Calculate the Destiny Using Jim's date of birth as an example, which is January the 17th, 1962, or 1 17 1962, comes up with the number 27. As you can see, we've added all the numbers of his birth date together. So when reduced to a single digit, 2 plus 7 equals 9. The Humanitarian. If your birth date reduces to a single digit with a 9 vibration, you are a Destiny 9. Those who possess a Destiny 9 have a global world view, which is all encompassing. 
meaning that they are compelled to help others and pass on the wisdom they've gleaned from their own lives. Young people with this destiny are often said to have old souls, and their capacity for compassion often leads them into areas where they are helping others. Dealing with endings and difficulties getting things off the ground can sometimes frustrate these people, but if they learn to accept the help from others, they can forge a truly awe-inspiring life that tackles world issues head-on. Seen as leaders with integrity and humanitarian pursuits, they are highly inspirational. And for Jim Carrey, it's interesting that he has the Nine Destiny, or Life Path, as well as the Eight Personality, because the Nine tends to soften the Eight a little bit. So the energy and the drive and ambition that he has will compel his Destiny Nine to get out there and really help people, which I think he does do. The Personal Year Calculate the personal year by adding your birthday and month to the year in question. The universal year for 1994 was 5. When reduced to a single digit, 1 plus 9 plus 9 plus 4 equals 23. Then we further reduce it to make 2 plus 3 equals 5. Jim's day of birth, the 17th, plus his month of birth, January, which was 1, is 1 plus 7 plus 1 equals 9. So 9 plus the universal year, which was 5, is 9 plus 5 equals 14, and reduced to a single digit, 1 plus 4 equals 5. A personal 5 can include freedom, travel, variety, changes, intellectual pursuits, and also gratification of the senses, among other things, especially to do with the mental and intellectual energies. So for him, in 1994, he had the double whammy of the five universal year and the five personal year. So everything was looking up for him. It was the year he broke through. The five always makes other numbers around it positive. So he was really riding high that year and became the hub of activity. Um, people were drawn to him. And from then on, he was able to build his great career. Angelina Jolie. Her date of birth is June the 4th, 1975. Her personality is four. Her destiny is five. And the pivotal event we'll be focusing on is 1998, which was a nine universal year and a one personal year for Angelina. Notable outcomes for 1998. Angelina's breakthrough role was when she portrayed supermodel Gia Karanji in the 1998 movie Gia. She went on the following year, which was a, per a personal year too, to act in Girl Interrupted, for which she won several awards, including an Oscar for Best Supporting Actress. The Personality 4 Those born on the following days, reduced to a single digit, have a Personality 4. 4, 13, 22, and 31. For example, 31 is 3 plus 1 equals 4. These people are reliable and duty-bound, with an attention to detail and a kind of pragmatism that can be annoying to those who prefer to throw caution to the wind. They are extremely practical and don't mind hard work, enjoying deep research and striving for efficiency, steady progress, and perfection. Those individuals with a personality 4 are down-to-earth types who have a strong need for structure and stability. They prefer regular routines and like everything in its place, finding disorder extremely distressing. They are sometimes considered to have bad luck, which could be the fact that they miss out on opportunities, not seeing the forest for the trees. Destiny 5 – The Globetrotter How to Calculate the Destiny Using Angelina's date of birth, June the 4th, 1975, which is 6-4-1975, comes to 32 when we add all the numbers in the birth date together. Reduced to a single digit, 3 plus 2 equals 5. The Globetrotter. If your birth date reduces to a single digit with a 5 vibration, you are a Destiny 5. The Destiny 5 is much more than a traveller, since they are guided by their intellect and love of freedom. 
which is interesting because the five is in contrast to the personality four. Hungry for adventure, this life path is all about mental stimulation, gratification of the senses, and chasing fascinating, even bizarre, experiences in order to quench their incessant desire for knowledge. The Destiny 5 strives to be everything to everyone, naturally operating as a hub of activity which others flock to. Experience is the key word for the Destiny 5, with a passion for discovering new and interesting things to add to their ever-growing repertoire. It helps if they can keep at least one foot planted firmly on the ground. And for Angelina, she has that with the Personality 4, so it seems like she might draw on those energies to give her a solid foundation when she's spreading herself out there, getting into it, learning new things, meeting new people, and starting new ventures. The Personal Year Calculate the personal year by adding your birthday and month to the year in question. The universal year for 1998 was 9, which is 1 plus 9 plus 9 plus 8 equals 27. Reduced to a single digit, 2 plus 7 equals 9. Angelina's day of birth, 4, plus her month of birth, 6, which is June, is 4 plus 6 equals 10. As a single digit, that's 1. 1 plus the universal year, which was 9, is 1 plus 9 equals 10. Reduced to a single digit, 1 plus 0 equals 1. So a one personal year is full of energy, new endeavours, independence, loneliness too. Um, sometimes in a one personal year you withdraw from other people so you can do stuff on your own without being impeded by anybody else's energies. Um, the one is also for original thinking and new endeavours as I said. So um, for that year of course she was branching out, it was the start of a new cycle and even though it was a nine universal year which is usually endings and unconventional happenings, I think that was a great combination for her to break out into the scene. If you want to learn more and dig deeper into your own numerological profile, take a look at the Portal's Numerology course. The full course is heavily discounted at $95. You save a whopping $180 and you get access to all the videos, course books and workbook, as well as the Portal Stormers community. Visit portals-numerology.teachable.com for more details and to register. I look forward to seeing you there.